My name is Emma van Eyck. I am the Director of Operations for Cape Classics. The company was founded by two brothers. They wanted to share with the world our beautiful wines of South Africa. So after extensive research, the US became a promising market and showed untapped possibilities. Our own range consists of three brands. We have the Jandra range. This is for those wine lovers that prefer their wine a little sweeter. Then we have our Indaba range. This is more the traditional varietals. And then we have our premier brand. This is the Bry wine. This pairs perfectly with any Bry meat. Some of the initial challenges that we faced in accessing the US market was that South African wines was very unknown at that stage. So here at Cape Classics, we believe that behind every farm, every winemaker, every bottle of wine, every grape, there's an untold story. And it's these stories that we gathered and shared with our clients. And this created um, a curiosity and interest, not only in South African wine, but also in South Africa as a whole. We have an amazing team. Their unwavering commitment and loyalty to the company and their attitude that they will do whatever it takes is definitely a driving force towards our achievements and they're definitely the heartbeat of Cape Classics. Part of our international marketing strategy was to change how we did sales. So we quickly adapted an online platform that our buyers could buy online opposed to from on consumption. I think some of the concerns international markets have with South African exporters is, are we uh, reliable? Can we constantly and timelessly supply our product? Because they are well aware of the production challenges that we face here in South Africa. So how we try and address that is accurate forecasting and advanced production to ensure that we are always fully stocked and that we can fulfill every order that we receive. This helps create a confidence that we can be relied upon irrelevant of what is going on around us. I think it would be wonderful if more South African companies started to export. I think it would offer opportunities and um, it would help diversify their revenue. I think advice that I would give people wanting to enter the export market is do in-depth research. Ensure that there is a demand for your product in the market that you're targeting and try and find an advantage like a trade agreement such as AGOA.